Hi, Damien Girardin here, co-founder and head of design at Reading, and I'm here today to talk to you about our brand new El Capitano foils. El Capitano is our brand new line of high aspect foils. They're designed for speed, glide predictability with an added bonus of like easy breaching of the wingtip in those tight turns. One of the main advantage of um, the higher aspect wing is that you just gonna glide further and longer uh, with the wing because it's got a longer span and a shorter cord. So you end up having less drag and uh, you can also pump a lot better because the shorter cord is gonna move less water when you're actually going up and down. So you're gonna really have the benefit of pushing on the water without slowing down every time you move the, the angle of attack or slowing down a lot less. So you're more, much more efficient at pumping. Uh, one very unique feature we have that we learned from our flight attendant on El Capitano is that um, outline that has that kind of a convex um, training edge and you know, and a rounded up a leaning edge also like most foils. But this keeps you very centered on the wing uh, where you're pushing on the wing. So it also helps the pumping a lot because you're wasting less movement of water because you're very centered onto the foil when you're riding. Finally, one thing that we definitely were really liking on Flight Attendant and we wanted to carry over on El Capitano is the way you can breach the wing tip of your wing and get out of the water. The, the way we got to that level is really by having a specific outline down in the wingtips where the wingtip actually goes to a concave shape just in that zone and the concave keeps the bubble out of that zone. We also have the end of the wingtip slightly going up, similar to what you see on an airplane where you, you kind of keep the vortex out of the, out of the main supporting surfaces. So it kind of does the same for the air bubbles on a, on a foil. So you really have those two advantages of uh, carried over from flight attendant into a higher performance, higher performing for now with El Capitano. Uh, when working on El Capitano, we definitely were uh, working on different profiles and the profile that ended up being our choice uh, really made the cut because it's got that negative on the bottom that technically uh, allows for a slight, you know, a size of the core that you actually visually see, see on the foil is what's gonna help you take off. So you have a very, like you still have a low speed take off thanks to the surface area of that cord. But once you're riding fast, really that negative in the, in the back of the, of the bottom of the foil kind of cancels itself and you end up with a, a, you know, an efficient cord that is shorter. So you have a foil that actually rides faster than the cord would suggest, while on the same time it takes off at the speed that that cord is suggesting. So, so you really have two different foils in one. The benefits of taking off at a relatively low speed with the benefit of being able to ride really fast with that, with that foil. So in addition to uh, the new front wing, we're also introducing two new stabilizers together with El Capitano, the 155 and the 180. Um, and they're really low uh, profile, so they're really fast. And the idea with this stabilizer is really to maximum your potential speed. So they really have the minimum amount of, amount of drag. And obviously we still have the trimming with the two screws so you can change your angle without having to put shims. So you can trim the amount of lift you want, more or less, depending on your preference. What's important for us is that El Capiano is can be mounted on the exact same fuselage and mast as what you may have already with your flight attendant. We have that very strong four screw connection between fuselage and front wing, which is very stable all the way to the 1695 wing that's a very uh, wide span. Um, and then the mast connection uh, using a conical connection to the fuselage is also very efficient with only two screws at an M6, but the way it's designed, the screws are only working properly in tension. So there's no shear load on them, so the screws stay very strong. You don't need the bigger screws. Um, finally, we're introducing a whole new construction for our carbon mass. We have a new lower section at 13.5 millimeters only. Uh, which means the very low drag on the mast, so they're very fast, and you notice when you're riding that there's very low drag on your mast. We have a double I-beam construction here with high modulus carbon, so the masts are really stiff, so it's very direct when you're riding. So you really get a foil that responds very well to all the input you're giving, because there's not too much movement wasted in the mast, or for in the fuselage for that matter, because the fuselage being full aluminum is also very stiff. El Capitano comes in a whole range of sizes, down from the 575, which is perfect for kite foiling, high end winging for the, the good guys, um, and then toe surfing if you're going on decent sized wave, then up to the 795 uh, and 995, which are gonna be your good 
uh, wing size for the good riders or the lighter riders. And then we go up to the 11.95, 13.95, which have similar shape, definitely for lighter wing or bigger riders uh, for winging. And then up to the 16.95, which is your perfect pumping wing or the really heavy rider on a, on a wing, but definitely 16.95 is a good, you know, uh, wing for uh, get going in light wind on the wing or if you want to get pumping or if you want to be starting your first downwinds because it's got a lot of a uh, lot of um, lift for you to get going at slow speed while still keeping the possibility to go really fast. So if you're looking at taking your folding to a whole new level being kiting, winging, proning, downwinding or pumping then look no further than El Capitano because I know you're gonna appreciate the added performance of that foil comfort to anything you've tried before.